everybody welcome back to my youtube channel welcome back to another video so today's video is going to be another haul <laughs> i know i've done quite a few hauls on my channel recently um but i will be doing some more styling videos very soon so do be sure to watch out for those but today's video i've done a bit of an order on mango because i saw some beautiful neutral new in pieces and I cannot not share them with you. So if you're excited for today's video, please give it a big old thumbs up. And without further ado, let me show you what I've picked up. So as always, I'm full frame of reference. I am five foot six and I typically wear a UK size eight or a size small, depending on the retailer. I am gonna be linking everything in the description box below in case you do see something you like. But the first thing I've picked up is this gorgeous short trench coat. Now, I have been looking for a shorter style of trench coat for the longest time. I saw one on our cat a while ago, but it sold out so, so quickly. So when I saw this one on Mango, I just had to have it. Now this one I picked up in a size small. It is made from Mango's Committed Range and it's Eco Vero material. And um, I love it because it is a really light, almost an oatmeal-y beige colour. So I was looking for something lighter for spring. I think come autumn, winter, I would go for a black version of this. Um, but because it's spring and the weather's looking a little bit better, I wanted to pick up this light one. I absolutely love it. I think this is so, so beautiful. I love the fact that it has this gorgeous flowing detail here. It has a tie waist detail, it has pockets. And the back is just very, very plain and simple. As you can see, it just looks absolutely stunning. It is gorgeous, I love it, and yeah, I'm gonna get so much wear out of this. <laughs> On maybe the opposite end of the spectrum to a coat, I've picked up this strap top because it is a beautiful cowl neck strap top in this gorgeous kind of champagne-y white color. Now I picked this one up in a size small. This one is made from recycled polyester. And as you can see, it is just a really, really beautiful cami. And I thought this kind of top would look so nice without a bra and then tucked in to jeans or a pair of trousers or a pair of black trousers with a pair of flip-flops would look amazing with this. Um, but I just wanted something a little bit more sophisticated for maybe an evening event or maybe drinks with the girls, something like that. Um, or like a date night, this would look amazing too. But I just loved the simplicity of it, but it's still quite detailed and it can still be a real statement piece. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to pick it up. Now, I am a huge lover of stripes. So I saw this top on the website and I couldn't just leave it there. So this one I picked up in a size small. It is 100% organic cotton and it is this three quarter length sleeve top. It is definitely a really lightweight material which I love because a lot of the striped tops I have at the moment are jumpers and they're more for kind of winter. So this one is definitely more of a spring summer top. Now the stripes are a navy blue rather than a black which I really really like. I think it makes a change and it makes it a little bit easier on the eye I think when there's less of a contrast but I love of this kind of this I'm not sure what to call it is it like a boat style neck I absolutely love it and the back is very plain and simple and as I say it's really really lightweight but it's still substantial enough that you are going to get coverage it's not going to be see-through or anything and I love the fact that the sleeves are three-quarter length as well I think they're going to look really flattering and yeah this is just the perfect kind of daytime top for spring. Now I wanted to try something a little bit new and a little bit of a trend piece and I've picked up these slouchy cropped high-waisted jeans, <laughs> all of the things, in a size 36 which is a UK 8 and these jeans are made from sustainable cotton and they're eco wash, they're from Mango's Committed range once again once again, which is just something I love about Mango. And um, these ones are a really gorgeous color, actually. They're kind of off-white. They're more of an ecru color. And I absolutely love them, actually. I'm not sure how they're gonna look on my figure, 
but I'm imagining these pulled up high waisted with a little black vest top or a black t-shirt belted in and um, with a pair of dad sandals I think these would look amazing that's how I think I'm going to try them on um, and yeah I think it's just an interesting cut of jeans they're very wide on the thigh and they are obviously slouchy um, but I just wanted to try them on and see what they look like on a I would say a rounder backside and thighs so you guys can get more of an idea of what they look like on someone who does not have the twiggiest legs. <laughs> Another absolutely classic staple piece I wanted to pick up from Mango is this white shirt. Now I picked this one up in a size small, so a size eight. It's made from sustainable cotton and actually it looks fairly big, I would say, for a size eight. Um, it feels amazing quality. Now I have got a white shirt that I wear quite a lot, which is from ASOS. Um, but this one is much thicker and it feels much better quality actually. So I think I'll probably get a lot of wear out of this one. I love the fact that a white shirt is so versatile. Um, if you find it interesting and helpful, let me know in the comments below if you wanted me to do a video on how to style white shirts or something like that. Um, let me know because I'd love to do one. And yeah, I just love the fact the buttons are a little bit multicolored. They're not white, so they add another dimension to the shirt and it just feels fab quality so yeah I'm excited to try this one on. Now I was looking for a new pair of trousers and I wanted a light pair of trousers. I wanted a more formal but relaxed pair so I found these ones on Mango and I got a size 8 so a size 36. These ones are also made from sustainable cotton and they're not quite coming up as yellowy as they are in real life. They do have a hint of yellow to them, um, but I love the fact that they're almost like a cargo pants style. They are high-waisted, they've got belt loops, so I would definitely wear these with a belt. Um, and then the back is very, very plain and simple. Um, they do have pockets, they feel amazing quality. Oh! <laughs> They feel amazing quality as always for Mango. Um, they might be ever so slightly cropped, but actually they look pretty good from a length point of view. As I say, I'm five foot six, so you can hopefully judge what they look like um, in the cutaways. And yeah, I just thought they were a really, really nice colour and again, obviously perfect for spring. So I must admit, I do have a slight obsession with shoes at the moment. So. I did pick up a couple of pairs of shoes from Mango, although one pair was from Mango Direct and another pair was from Mango via ASOS, but I wanted to show you them both in today's video. So the first pair of these, these are made from sustainable leather. I picked them up true to size in a size six and I've tried them on and they are definitely true to size. And they are just a, I would say a off beige, very, very neutral coloured pair of sandals with this gorgeous leather strap. And they do have the slightest bit of heel to them and just to add a little bit more detail. But I just thought for these, for these spring, summer months, these sandals will be absolutely perfect. Um, I don't actually have a lighter pair at the moment. So these are gonna go with so much in my wardrobe. And then the other pair are a bit of a trend shoe, which I tried them on and showed my boyfriend. And I said to him, I was like, do you like these shoes? And he looked at them and he was a bit like, no. Um, but they are a chunky flip flop. So these are a black chunky sandal. These ones are the ones that I got via ASOS. Um, again, these are very true to size and I actually really like them. I think these look so chic with a pair of black trousers or even like an all white outfit with a pair of chunky flip flops. They have a bit of a heel to them, which I love. Um, and then this bit is really cushioned. You know, sometimes this bit can really dig into you on a standard flip flop. This is actually really puffy and soft. So it kind of molds to your feet, but I thought these were an absolutely fab dupe for the more expensive pairs of chunky sandals that you can get. Um, so yeah, these ones are by ASOS. I will link them down below as well. But even though he didn't like them, I really like them. <laughs> Another accessory I picked up was a little bag. This is just a little tiny kind of baguette bag. Um, this one is just one size and it's just this really pretty neutral color. Um, again, I just wanted something a little bit more neutral because 
All of my bags tend to be quite black. Um, I don't know if I'm going to keep this one, only because it's slightly pinker than I imagined it to be. Um, yeah, I thought it was a really, really cute bag. And then I did also get a pair of sunglasses. Now, I saw these on Instagram and I love them so much. But the only problem is my head shape is just not great for sunglasses because I have such a round head. Um, sunglasses don't tend to suit me that much unless they are kind of round. So these are the sunglasses. I actually really, really like them. They're a very kind of retro aviator kind of style with a bit of an orangey brownie tint as you can see. Do you think I can wear these with my face? Let me know in the comments. I don't know if I can get away with them. Maybe. And that's everything that I picked up from Mango. I really, really hope you enjoyed the video, guys. I've had so much fun filming it. If you did enjoy it, please give it a big old thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, please feel free to hit that subscribe button for new videos from me every single week. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.